one of the issues we've faced in China is that in the culture it's important to be part of the group and you as a group you're functioning and a group you're succeeding and a group you're failing but when you're making the targets very specific they often also become individual and suddenly you can start I think people feel pointing fingers at individuals which of course is not the objective the objective is to make it clear to everybody how am I contributing to the company and what are my targets what should I do to make better but uh, our employees are often afraid that this is used just to single them out and be able to point fingers at them and say, are they successful or not? So it's very difficult to make the targets individual as specific when it comes to that. And that so it takes, a long, it takes a long time every year uh, to break down the overall corporate strategy. I then try to focus more on the department of functional goals and targets and say, this is what we have to achieve. And that's what's important and that's what where our overall success or failures will be measured. But in order to achieve them, we have to help each other and break this down to what do we as individuals have to do, but put more, less focus on how we measure and what are the, what are the uh, consequences of the individual targets and more focus on what are, what are the consequences of achieving or not achieving the group targets or the function targets. As such. So that's how we try to move the emphasis. Whereas in, you can say in US, you would be very, very individually orientated. Most of your bonus would come from your individual targets. Whereas here we try to say, okay, how we calculate the bonus and so on. It's more on the on the department or function uh, targets. So people can feel that it's not a singling out. That's not the issue. The issue is we're trying to plan our work down to an individual level by planning our targets down to an individual level level but the overall that's the important stuff